recent setting session with Lauren Carlini, Outstanding Freshman Setter for the University of Wisconsin, we focused on jump setting both forward and backward and also setter attacking. So as you see as Lauren goes through her jump setting sequence, there's a couple commonalities that good setters will want to put into their repertoire of skills. First, her starting position. She starts with her back to the net, facing where the ball is coming from or the passer. Her first step is with the left foot that will take her to the ball. And most setters would do some form of a left-right sequence or left foot hop. And when Lauren is jump setting, she tends to get into a hop sequence. Now she'll also do left-right and jump, and there's no right or wrong. What's important is that they get into a setting rhythm, which she does a great job of. She's gotten to the ball, she's done her hop, she's, now she's in the air, but notice her contact point and how her hips are squared away to her target. Full arm extension directly to her target, and no part of her body is going away from where she wants the ball to go. Now you'll see this sequence in slow motion where it's left step, slight rhythm hop. As she jumps, she turns and squares up to her target, and then it's full arm extension all the way through the ball out to where she wants the ball to be delivered. And now at full speed, the same thing. Different angle, but the same skill. Left step, slight hop, square the hips, full arm extension through the target. Left step, right, hop. So again, it's either left, right, or left foot hop. And, you know, I want to repeat, there's no right or wrong, but jump setting's all about rhythm. You know, so she does her foot sequence to get her into a rhythm. And then as you can see, she squares up and has full arm extension. Now from in front, you can see how it's, how she squares up and pushes through the ball. Same mechanics when she's back setting. It's left foot for the ball, slight hop, squares up to left front, and then she'll deliver the ball behind her. But until she actually delivers the ball, there's no change in mechanics. You know, and the thing we really want to prioritize is on contact, her hips face left front. And so many setters, especially if they come off the net a little bit, they tend to, you know, open their hips up and they're not squared to left front. And these sets tend to drift too tight to the net. But Lauren does a wonderful job of squaring up to her target all the time. Now from behind her, you can see how when she actually touches the ball, her hips, her toes, everything is facing left front. Now Lauren's going to demonstrate a couple keys relative to the setter attack. A couple points of emphasis. One is she'll always go up with two hands, replicating the setting motion, and then extend with her left arm to attack the ball. And notice how her contact is at her right shoulder. So she lets the ball cross her body a little bit to her right shoulder, and that's her contact point. So she'll go up with two hands, as you see, and then extend with either her left or, or right hand to attack, depending on where she's trying to put the ball. But the contact point is going to be on her right shoulder. Okay, so replicate the setting motion up with two, extend high with one to attack the ball to various aspects of the court.